Now, a special report from the southern border. It's a problem with no easy answers. What should be done to secure the U.S.-Mexico border? President Trump wants a wall and declared a national emergency to try and get it. MTN's Russ Reisinger is at the southern border right now, taking a closer look at the issue and has a preview of what he'll be reporting on this week. I'm standing here on the banks of the Rio Grande right across from Mexico. It's a long ways from Montana, but what's happening here concerns many of you back home. In our MTN MSU poll that we did last fall, 65% of those who responded, both Democrats and Republicans, said that illegal immigration is a serious concern. And law enforcement has told us time and time again that many of the drugs that plague Montana come from Mexico. We headed to the border along with Montana U.S. Senator John Tester. About how many people are you apprehending a day here? Well, we have a thousand people a day. Like a thousand here. people a day. Pero un muchacho grande ya. Ya no te va a pasar nada. Border patrol stays busy 24/7 here in the Rio Grande Valley. The issue at hand is does a physical, contiguous physical wall solve the problem? To me, that's the debate. We've got to deal Thanks with what's causing Coming the back. problem of this immigration situation. It's, uh, if we don't get to the root problem, we're not going to be able to be successful in, in a lot of what we're trying to do here. This week, I'll be taking a closer look at the situation here and also what's being done to protect our borders. We'll also find out what Senator Tester thinks after making a visit here. Near McAllen, Texas, I'm Russ Riesinger reporting for MTN News.